My original fascination with wanting to be a musician uh, came about because my family is Lebanese, and in the early days uh, when we were kids, there was all these um, what they would call hufflies or picnics. I mean, I see, I saw my dad and my uncles all playing. Either they would they would sing. Some people they played a clarinetish instrument. Uh, some people played oud, the Arabic lute. Uh, and but most of the most of it was very basic in singing and playing, you know, drums and dancing. And but they all knew the tunes that everybody sang, and it was just looked like, you know, I'm in. I could do that. So I remember telling my dad after seeing it one time, I just told him, "So you get me that drum, the Arabic drum was was a darbuka. So you get me that, I could play it." And so uh, as certain things start to resonate with you and you start to pay attention to those things, your, your world starts to expand. And when you've left the farm, more or less, your world becomes you know, a bigger playing field. When you start to get experience with that, you get a lot more respect for the traditional aspect of what's happening in music, because most of it has a sensible aspect of the lifestyle that you know, is um, embracing some sort of religious thing, usually early on, or some sort of ceremonial thing early on. That's no joke. If you're a drummer and you're paying $60,000 a year to go to college to study drumming, you might want to go somewhere where people are drummers for life and never spend two cents to learn how to do it and they'll play us under the table because they, they, it's part of their tradition. They, are, they play for ceremonies that have deep significance to their cultures and when they do it, it just transcends and you get what it is that you need to know more about. As an example of that, I've been in Paul Simon's band now for 18 years, and we were on the bus, and something was on African music thing, and the drumming was incredible, the dancing, people were flipping in the air, and it was like, just, I mean, unworldly, like, you know, it's like, who does this? I mean, like, my God. So Vincent came out, I said, Vincent, check that out. And he looks at it, he goes, ah, if you play that in my village, nobody would dance. I was like, wow. It's like everything's contextual, everything's regional.